we're back! Avgum. Avgum! I don't know what it stands for. 24 hour development. Wow. That must have been some sort of challenge That's they set themselves. Super impressive. Okay. So game made for the 48 hour global game jam. Game jam games can be great. There's a really rad uh, VR. Normal. There's Kids a, love it. There's a super. Click the switch to make items appear. And then drag items to move them. There's a super rad game made during a game jam that is a VR game where you are a ghost who was a dentist in life, right? This okay. is a really cool game. And you have to... So you're possessing someone and performing dental surgery on them to help them. So you put a VR helmet on and you see yourself and you have to perform dental surgery on your own mouth. Weird. Because you're possessing the person and then like... Doing dentistry on their own mouth. So I don't really. Sometimes is that, am I just building a room? Jam games turn out really well. This is super weird. I think you're just like arranging a room. Uh, it's I a mean, bin. The bucket would that would go on the floor. Oh, put the bone in the bin. I mean, the bone would go in the bin. I would think. It just goes on no, top of it. Don't put meat boy in the bin. No, it just go, it goes on top of it. We'll just arrange them as you see fit, buddy. Whoop, I what got a, uh, a computer. computer. Well, oh, oh, can we put the little meat guy on the monitor? Like he's on the screen? Yeah. But like, like on the screen, like as if he's like a program. Oh, yeah, we can do that. I'm just going to shorten that. I'm, just, I'm, I'm seeing it's possible. It is possible. You can put him on top if you want, dude. Oh, I'm not telling you how got to Got a jaw. Him. Oh, we're collecting a fossil. Got a bone. <laughs> Uh, I always got a bone. Is this just sort of like a discomforting game? Like it that doesn't actually have a purpose? Was weird. I mean, let's find out. I reckon this doesn't have a purpose. We're gonna find out. Is that a door? It's a bookshelf. Oh, but it goes in front of things. Or it can. Can you put things on it? Interesting. So whatever oh, okay. you select. Oh, sweet. Lasts. Let's put stuff on the bookshelf. It's gonna so be fun. Do that. I'm gonna organize the shit out of this room. It's like that. That bin's gotta go like here. This is just making me want to clean up my own house. Like, yeah. I mean, I have tidying that I could be doing right now. Oh no, sorry, Meat Boy. Meat Boy can go on a shelf. Wow. Yeah. Like this jawbone. Yeah, the jawbone should go on the shelf. Yeah, get the jawbone there. We're gonna put this bone over yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna look real nice. It's gonna Fuck be nice. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna look real, real good. good. Real nice. Oh! The number just like jumps sometimes. Another bomb. Oh, so we're collecting bones. Do 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 do. Wop bop boobity boop. Nobody. What even happened there? I don't know, but I don't care. Ah! Look, it's, crappy flowers. Some sort of some sort of vase That's or vase. Cute. I'm just gonna put it there. I'm gonna put the computer way over here. God, it's so. This is. We should put an epilepsy warning at the start of this one. We're going to turn the light off and on, and uh, we're going to okay, collect another arm. a nice little bone man here. I'm gonna. What am I gonna build? Like an entire person skeleton? Maybe. Oh, look, we're making progress in the bottom left. I can see, but so I don't know what it does. There's an endpoint here. Well, it tells us there's an endpoint. Oh, you know what? There Hold should. Up. There should just be a single flick. You shouldn't have to. Stop if that starts to hurt. Ooh. Let's go, motherfuckers! Just make sure you take a break if that starts uh, to hurt your hand. Ah, oh, cramp. Stop. <laughs> no, I'm good. It's Perfect. a little fetus. It is a little fetus. <laughs> this is a dumb way to control this. It should just be a single flip <sighs> on and off. Oh Agreed? God. Yes. Ugh, oh, it's a creepy skull. Oh, it's a skull thing. Look, pencils. Why is up. it shouldn't make you flick it like a hundred times? Finally, we get a desk. All right, <laughs> now we can put shit on the. I guess the computer should probably go on the desk. Yeah, probably. So and, there's a rug. Yeah, rug, desk, photo, computer, pens. That just makes sense. There's not room for the pens. God damn it. So I put that like that. <laughs> and we put that like that. Ah, uh, we're not even halfway through. No! Oh, there was a cat! Oh, no! Oh, there was a cat. That's what appeared when we thought nothing appeared. Yeah. That cat is... No, it's alive. Maybe. Sort of? D <laughs> Avgum. What does Avgum stand for? Uh... 
audiovisual game man. Games man. Native. Native. Oh, so that jaw is at the bottom of that skull. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. See? I have a jaw now. And look, a, another the? bone. I, I don't think that bone goes with that. It entity. has to. Okay. Oh, so much clicking. Why? Why, Ed? One click is what should be required here. We got window! Alright. We got window. You know what this is making me think of? What? Because Ed and these guys got their start making games on Newgrounds. Maybe not the start, but they put a lot in there. Do you remember back in the 90s playing Flash games? All those, like, Dress people up game. Yes, yeah, absolutely. This is making me think of those. It is kind of like that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And I'm, inevitably, the ones on Newgrounds just got naked. Got naked. Yeah, absolutely. The, yeah, thank yeah, I you. I remember because there were shitloads of them that were PG, and you just you dress people up and put them around a the house and stuff. But the ones on Newground, it was like you take off the clothes and oh, they're naked. <sighs> Biting social commentary. I don't want to have to do this another like three hundred times. Just stop. Yep. But. <laughs> ah, I knew you wouldn't really be able to stick with this stuff. <laughs> Let me take over for a bit. Yeah, sure, you click for a Yeah, no, you have bird arms. I'm fine. Click time. Yeah, you click for a while. It's gonna fucking... I'm gonna lie here like a king. While you just click the switch. Well, what do we get? A leg. I'm telling you, it's oh, a fucking skeleton. Fucking shelf. You just... I'll just put the corner It needs to be there. at least visible, yeah. Yeah. Alright. More oh my things. God. Oh, Jesus. I mean, we're more than halfway, right? Like, at this point. Yeah, but how many clicks does it take per item now? I don't know. And you why? know what? This is really bad for you and me to be doing. Yeah. Have you, do you, um... Have you ever had the thing where you end up turning light switches off and on? Oh, the OCD? The OCD thing. Uh, light switch is not so much for me. Has that been a thing for, for you? Sorry, it's just awkward for me to lean over there. No, the, light switch is not so much. That is a, um, has been a big thing for me. Have we talked about this before? I think we've talked about the fact that we I have I think OCD. we have talked about our OCD before. Um, um, it's, it's a joy. I've, I've <laughs> discovered, because I'm doing a lot more driving lately for work and stuff. Sure. What the? Oh, another oh, rug. It's a rug. That um, I... I do that thing where where I think every 10 seconds I check the rear view to see if I've hit somebody. Holy uh, shit. Yeah. I bet I'm going to start doing yeah, that. Yeah, absolutely. Because I'm learning to drive right now. Like, so. I think that I've I've run a red light, that I've hit a dog, that I've no. run over a person, that I've got that no. I've gotten to an accident, like, and I just don't know it. Like, it's it's a whole mess. I used to do light switches. I haven't in a while. It's light switches. Um, and it oh. used to drive Nally crazy. Because um, I would be like... Flick of lights, which is on now. She'd be like, "Why the fuck are you doing that?" I'd be like, "Cause I'm counting." Cause I'm counting them. Oh God, I'm sorry. Bad things from happening by yeah, flicking yeah. the switch on and off. She's like, "That's <laughs> yeah. not. That's not. It's the not thing. a thing." You're like, "Shut up! It is a thing." Yeah. Oh God. She's right though, and I shouldn't do it, and I don't. These yeah, days, but I mean, but should and you yeah, know. That's I mean? the like, that's the the compulsion part of the compulsion, OCD, motherfucker. Is that you feel like you have it's to. It's the pits. It's, it's the fucking. Pits, it's man. shitty. I don't mean to like bring it up and. What? Like, I don't know. Well, what? It's no big deal. I don't know. I just, if you don't want to talk about it. I have no umbrage talking about it. I'm very open about it. <sighs> I used to very much I get that the be. story. The story is telling you is that this guy's alone and he hung himself. That's it. I mean, yeah, that seems to be where this is going. That doesn't look like a human, though. That looks like the man from the Black Lagoon skeleton thing. Oh my man. god, it's going to be so hard to, like, ugh, this is such a. No, this is boring! It's boring, Ed! Ed! This is dumb! This is Why dumb. are you making us do this? Why did you think this was a good idea for a game? This is bad and you should feel bad. It is bad and you should feel bad. Look, a spider. I I love... Oh, uh, no. I'm Audi. Yeah, me, you know what? Yeah. The Audi. Yeah. Was made in five hours for the 40 hour. Yeah. Yeah, it feels that way. It, yeah, it kind of does. It was bad. Cool. Well... Complete ether to unlock, complete time for cock to unlock, spewer. We won't be doing any of those things! Nope. Music to make love to, though. I mean... Huh? Oh, 
just all right. It just, just opens straight up opens That's the cool. uh, the the soundtrack. Great. Well, that was the basement. That was collection. the basement collection. We did not finish any of these games. We came close with a couple. No. We I think um, we did what finish. What did you Coil. think overall, Jordan? Um. Overall, I no, we did not finish. Quote. We did. That's we... why the star is there. Okay, so we got one of the endings. No, yes. I, I think there's only one ending. No, it. That, anyway, yeah, it doesn't matter. I um, look, I think a lot of the games were quite fun. They felt like what they were, which was online, you know, like flash games, and also games that are art. Yes, which is something that you kind of have to give to to Ed and Danny and all these guys yep. who work on these games. They're making really rad indie games that that feel like art. And there are a lot of games that are like, we're art! And they're not, they're just shitty. Um, but these games are not that. They feel like this is a game that is art. And maybe not all of them are for me, but yeah. they are legitimately a piece of artwork that is also a I agree. Game. I think that this was uh, a really interesting collection to kind of look through the evolution of him as a as a game maker. And all these other awesome, talented people that he works yes, with. Yes, obviously, everyone um, else too. I mean, I guess I say him because he's the guy Because we know, know his story, I will but say we don't know this, everyone else. Every yeah. single soundtrack person deserves credit. Absolutely. So, Danny Baranovsky, John Eric Kada, Tin, the Tin Hat Trio, Tyler and Danny, Justin Carpel, uh, Danny again. Danny again, Danny again. Danny's the Binding of Isaac guy. You guys so we fucking the... made the atmosphere for every single one of those games, besides yeah. um, Ed McMillan's like art style. And we love the Isaac soundtrack because Absolutely. Jordan and I have played obsessive. Amounts Although I will of say, I think Triagnus is my favorite soundtrack. Really? Yeah. Interesting. Um, because it was just it. It felt like contemporary indie games mm. or independent games where there was like that kind of it's like a little bit. Um, you know, you got some violin going on, you got mm. some... Not classical, it's not quartet, but like, I don't know, it just mm. felt good. Like a soundtrack that I would listen to. For people that want to play this, it is super Although cheap it's on the Steam store. How much the, is it on Steam? It's like five bucks, and I'll it's usually on sale it. for like half price. Like, I got the physical version as well for no good reason. You know what we could do? Because I don't need the keys for either of those. So mm. we could like give them away. Yeah. We'll, we can something. think about doing a we'll little think giveaway. about it. Maybe we'll do a giveaway or something That'd be fun. at some point. Because I bought physical copies of both Binding of Isaac and the Basement Collection, which I have not used the keys for because I own them on Steam. Um, I just bought them because the boxes are pretty. And I'm going to keep the box, but maybe one of you out there can have the keys. We'll think about it. All right. Um, well, we'll catch you all. That's kind of cool that you can do that. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. We will catch you all on the flip side for whatever it is that we're going to play next. But hey, look, we finished a thing. We did finish a thing. We finished we a thing. We read your comments. We yeah. know that there are a lot of... <laughs> look, okay, let's be real. We know we need to finish Spookies. a lot of things. We need to finish Spookies. We need to finish our Jalopy Run. Panzer Models. Um, we need to finish Panzer Models. We mean to do all of these things. It's just... Well, okay. Time gets away from you. Jordan and I, we're fairly busy people. And when we come together to do this... We tend to pick something we feel like playing. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> so the issue. So sometimes we don't feel like playing those games, and and sometimes um, Jordan gets incredibly frustrated with Spookies because we do the same 350 oh. rooms like four times, oh. and 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 you know what? I think he's got a point there. Oh. Um, We'll get there. We will get there. We'll the the, get the there. final bits of Spookies are really rad. Uh, for those of you out there who know where it knows where it goes, um, I think Jordan's gonna I love it. I promise we'll be, we'll play it. We will finish these games. We just are gonna maybe not do them all in the order that maybe would make more sense yeah. because we are strange and mysterious. Mysterious. Um. We will also. But we be, got a lot of games planned. Yeah, we'll also be playing some PUBG at some point, and I might continue yep. my solo Fortniteing, depending on how I feel about Do it. I play some PUBG, and I, which is not something I've actually talked to you about, but I have acquired and downloaded a bunch of games from my childhood Ooh. and from from that I really love. Is this, did I also? Yeah, I gave you the list of games from my childhood. You did, and I, I have compiled that, and I, I have nice. a Word document that I add things to that I have had for a couple of years now, and there's lots of things on it. And um, what I am going to do is show you some of my favorite games that nice. I have discussed with you that you've never played before. And we can sort of... If we can get a copy of The Neverhood... I have a copy of it. Oh, good! Fucking love that game. Yeah, get that fucking dragonfly, buddy. Yeah, we gotta do it. Oh. And then we can play Armor Croc, which I have. And we can talk about art versus artist in yes, video we games. Because, because we love... Help me out well, with his name well, again. Doug Tenable? We love Doug Tenable's... 
Games. Games. And the <laughs> comics, too. But And the comics. But he has some opinions. We has, he has some opinions we don't, we don't like. <laughs> Alright! We'll see you guys next time. Thanks for joining us. We finished the thing. We did it. Yay! Yay! Bye! Peace out. Oh no, we have to kill Ed again. Bye, Ed. <laughs> Ed, you'll be fine. Stop it. <laughs>